impossible. What power is this? How can one human's power alone be enough to best me? Hino Kagutsuchi. That's what holds you back. The power I wield. The power we wield. We will never succumb to someone like you. Silence, pest! I will not lose! I am stronger than anything! Persona! Adachi-san? <sighs> what are you doing? I set everything up perfect for you, and you still didn't finish it off before I woke up. Spacing out for. I don't have time to waste either. So let's hurry up and put it into this. Right. Izanagi. Nagatsu Izanagi. Hino Kagutsuchi! The malice has been defeated, but your true battle begins here. After all that has happened, I'm eager to see what you will do. Forgive my insolence, but the fight about to transpire piques my interest. I wish to witness its outcome. <laughs> Show. Where is he? I don't know. He was trying to protect you from Kagutsuchi. I see. When I woke up, I was in the hospital. I didn't know anyone there, or even how long I'd been out. My care was paid up for basically forever. I 
had a pretty good idea where the money came from. Shuchi Kutsuki. Yeah. The same goddamn bastard who tampered with an orphan kid and threw him away like yesterday's garbage when I blacked out. That lab was everything to me. I did everything I could when I was a kid. I was happy to see that rotten bastard smile. Show. Eh, it doesn't matter. Anyway, all that was left for me when I woke up was a shit ton of money and a world I never knew. You get it, right? All I know is fighting. I don't have a damn clue how to live in this world. I left the hospital and went out into the world. Yeah, that's right. Into your Inaba. What? You were in Inaba? Yeah, and it sucked. It was so boring I thought I was gonna die. That's when the murder case broke on that foggy day. Don't tell me. That's right. I saw it all. I saw what you did, what you fought against, and how you solved the case. It was fun. It got my blood pumping. I got the scent of battle. And I thought you were just like me. Then right when that case was just about closed, that thing spoke to me. It asked if I wanted to destroy the world. You're talking about Kagutsuchi? Yeah. Minazuki came up with the plan, and I went with it. And then... You know the rest. Show, don't be afraid to bond with people. <laughs> You're like Labrys, someone who was made to fight, so that's all they know. But she's one of our good friends now. Still. <laughs> Still, the only way I can relate to you all is by fighting. All right, then. Huh? If fighting is the only way you can form bonds, then I'll fight you till the cows come home. Just don't drag anyone else into it. Here goes. Final. Can you take it? Closing it! Damn! Just go! One more! Here! Not enough! Here! Not enough! It's a right trick! We all done! Closing it! Gotcha! Oh! <laughs>
It's over. Show me Nazuki. To think he'd take so quickly to the persona passed down from the self born of that plume of dusk. It's been a while since we've had a guest with that much power. <laughs> I presume Sho will be a rather dreadful underclassman for him. I truly look forward to what develops of this. Ah, so that red-haired young man has reached an epiphany. Yes. The many encounters he had here have brought about a change within him. He'll surely have many more experiences and battles on his journey from here on. As a new guest of the room. Elizabeth, will you not return to us? Theo was worried about you. I believe he had been to this place as well. Oh, did he? I hadn't noticed at all. Not even a raindrop's worth. Uh, is that so? Well then, it seems the time has come for me to take my leave. Please tell my incompetent brother this. My journey has just begun. Ah, oh, Elizabeth. I sense that you may become a guest of our room someday yourself. <laughs> How do you feel, Sho? I lost. That's the brawn of a guy with bonds, huh? <laughs> uh, never mind. Even my jokes are lame right now. Come at me whenever you want. As often as you want. I'll always accept the challenge. So what are you gonna do now? I meant it when I said that the others would... Ah, that's enough. I'm tired of all your lecturing. <laughs> I'll kill you for sure one day. You better be ready when I come for you. It seems it's over. And that was a wonderful battle. It even made my heart skip a beat. <laughs> I'll look forward to your rematch with him. I'd be fine if he didn't show up for a while. Is that so? This encounter between you two will one day give way to something irreplaceable. I don't know your desires, but that may be the nature of the power you hold. <laughs> Who knows? Bye. Now that the red fog is gone, this place will disappear shortly. Shouldn't your friends evacuate more urgently? Margaret, I have a favor to ask you. Oh? What is it? Could you please send all my friends here in the tower somewhere safe? <laughs> 